come to the conclusion I'm not going to change anybody's opinion. And by and like with my wife, we don't try. Like the goal of this is not to get people who hate trans people to like us. I don't care if you hate us. Don't. Don't like us. It's the people who do like trans women but are afraid to talk about it. It's like, this is what it is. Just fucking date who you want to date and, and stop being so secretive about it. Stop taking this whole group of people and pretending you don't like them because you're afraid people are going to call you a homo. That's all it is. Do you think that that's what a, a, the the lion's share of transphobia is? Is is it like subverted or transmuted or whatever, repressed sexual attraction? Or is it just, what do you think, like percentage-wise? Because to me, it's still just like, that's different. And I it terrifies me. I don't like different things. It's a combination. I, think, I, I really don't know what the yeah. percentage, some of it is people who really want to fuck and they see someone like, ah, oh, fuck you. Like, you know, it's like the old Bobcat bit about like beating up a gay guy because you're attracted to him. Uh, I mean, there's, you know, and I know a, a lot of trans women and a lot of uh, the guys they've slept with who are public figures who they, they you know, and they shouldn't name them if the guys right. don't want to be named. Some of it is repressed transphobia, like they want to suck dick, but they don't want to act like they want to suck dick. Some of it is just true religious feelings of this person is an abomination. Some of it is indifference that turns into anger and revulsion because of what special interest groups do. Right. Some of it is, I was kind of like, eh, it's not for me, but, uh, and then all of a sudden you're, uh, you're saying that like, hey, this is the way sports should be and this is the way that should be. Um, and then people push back on that. But then again, I think the conservatives are full of shit too. Acting yeah. like you shouldn't acknowledge trans people are right. people. Like, and if you mention something transgender to a child, and you're they're to dying to get them. into bathrooms. Yeah, I mean, you know, I don't they know just, if this was my thought or somebody else's, but like, they're worried about a guy becoming a woman to molest your daughter, and it's like, you know, there's lesbians in the women's bathroom. Yes, I've thought of that with with gay men, like too, yeah. like, like boy, the Boy Scouts. Yeah, I mean, Jesus Christ, that was a fuck fest for eighty years. Yeah, and and all of a sudden now it's just, but there are like, look, are there trans people that do it? Sure, but I, that's not the reason. Especially, I, I got I don't think there are. Honestly, you'll find some, I think, like that change their gender right before they go to jail. And there have been. Right. Like, that's OK. That just sounds like something. But like thing about becoming a woman so I can be around little kid. Oh, no, no. I don't think full transitions. I mean, yeah. people that probably aren't really trans. But again, like then there are certain times where there's legit things that are dismissed by like, you know, you had like the people looked at. I forget what the state was where the. The uh, girl said she was assaulted by a boy in a dress sexually in school, and the school board wrote it off like, ah, this dumb hillbilly, but it turns out it was right. Like, the school board was covering something up, and this guy who seemed like this fucking, oh, this guy's a MAGA maniac, but he was right. It had happened to his daughter. So a lot of times people will write off any right. criticism, and it could be valid. It's just a matter of being truthful without, without saying the outcome has to be this yeah you know what i mean like yeah nikki and i are married we're legally married um i resent anybody that doesn't want us to have the exact same life they have so anybody that thinks that my wife and i should not be able to behave the way you and your wife should behave go fuck yourself like that's how yeah. we look at it um i don't know what the answer for the kid stuff is i, I don't yeah have I, I don't i have I no don't. feelings well, about like it. well the the as someone who transitioned she was 14 that's that's like that seems to be where a lot of like the I think legitimate controversy should not even controversy of just like, what are we doing here? Yeah. Yeah. Like, which I'm not, I don't think it's, I don't think it's wrong. I don't think it's a fake argument. It's like, no, this is a real thing. It's a real point. What's the right thing? Um, and by transition, she just started taking Medicaid. Oh, you know what I mean? That's yeah. basically it. Like what's the right age for that is, is 10 too young maybe, but yeah. again, with no kids and I don't have any feelings about kids whatsoever. Like, I, whatever they decide. I, I just don't know what's right. Yeah, I don't either. Uh, which is another thing. People don't go like, I don't know. Yeah. I, don't, I can see both sides. So. I, I talk about this on stage. It's the reason I haven't shot a special is I'm still trying to figure out like, what do I want to say? Like, I talk about our sex and I like to talk about it because it's jarring to people sometimes yeah. when you, when, and then they realize I'm not kidding. Like, no, no, this is real. Well, that's what's interesting because when I think about your sexual stuff, if I may interject like that. So do you ever look down at Nikki and be like, this is a, I didn't see this coming, but I guess you did. I did. Oh yeah. What, what do you mean by the reaction? <laughs> like, you mean or? no? Like your I literally I was thinking of your point of view, first person. So you're either behind her. Oh, do you know what I mean? Yeah. 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 Oh and, no, I'm like, never shocked. I mean, like it's 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 she's who I want to be with. Everything yeah. about her is exactly what I want. Great. Um. So no, I never. Uh, 
I think she disarms. Well, it's again, I'm projecting. I'd be surprised. Oh, of course. Yeah, yeah. Most guys. <laughs> if are If I looked down, and that was. So I dick. Oh yeah. Most guys aren't though. They pretend they are. They pretend they don't know. Uh, a big part of it is self-identifying too. Yeah. Like trans women have to realize, like, yes, you're obviously a huge part of the discussion, but the reason that the men don't come out, many reasons. One is guys are afraid. Does it make me gay? And you can't dismiss that. Go, you're totally heterosexual because there's not a rational thinking person alive that thinks a guy has a dick in his face and he's heterosexual. Right. You can tell yourself that. You can identify that way if you want to. It's not my fucking business. Yeah. But I find it to be ludicrous and laughable. And I think it, it causes a lot of confusion with people. Um, and I think a lot of people just walk away from you and think this is crazy. Uh, but guys just don't know how to identify if they like somebody transgender. They're like, does it make me gay? Does it not make yeah. me gay? I think that's a big part of it. But I, but that said, it's like you fucking cowards. Just admit the group you like. You don't have to say what you do sexually. Everyone has private stuff sexually. Right. But uh, don't just deny it and stop getting caught. I think it's probably they don't want to have to be the same politically thing. It's like you. I don't want to have to pick a team because there are a lot of things about that particular team that I just am aggravated by or sure. don't want to be a part of. But it's also- But you're also right about it's fear. They're not publicly dating any of you know, mo, mo, There's a lot of people in public life who like trans women who are not dating them publicly or taking them to dinner or taking them to uh, uh, award yeah. shows. And it's like, I'm not the only one who likes trans women. I mean, believe me when I tell you, I'm really not. No. So the fact that none of them are doing it shows you that there's more there. Did you figure out, so how do you talk about on stage? I mean, I start with talking about her as a person, uh, the things I hate about her as a, you know, yeah. anything else in a relationship, being married, uh, just regular shit, banal yes. shit that's true. She's yes. fucking always cold. She, you know, all this Other shit. people are annoying, and if they're of a different gender, they might be a little more annoying. Yes. And then I hit them with the fact, I mean, most people now who are coming to see me know already, but the way I get into it, they're like, oh, maybe this is a different person. But then I hit them with it, and... Uh, it gets a really finally he's back with regular women. It, that, but they, what? But they're like, what is he doing? Because I've seen some people who know our channel and they know her, and then what the fuck is he doing? And then uh, when I, then the joke comes. It's like a really weird laugh. Like, oh yes, okay, this makes sense. And then I go on and talk about her dick and the sex and the stuff like that. Uh, that where it's hard, where it's not hard. The arguments everyone's having. And, yeah. You know, but I want to get it right. Like, I, and by right, I mean just funny. I want to make sure yeah. it's funny. And I'm not being self righteous, and, not, and also, and not being like activist. And no, like, I refuse. I'm trying. Yeah, I absolutely refuse. Our love is just as real. Yeah. Hey, did you like that? Did you like that? Yeah. Did you like it though? You want more? Don't want to work? Would rather watch videos of me grab assing with people? First of all, go up here to subscribe, and then go up here to uh, watch more clips. This is like when the weatherman says that there's a high pressure system coming in. I'm not really used to the green